welcome back to my channel today we are going to be filming a quick craft with me or hopefully it's kind of quick i'm actually going to be um making or i'm going to be redecorating this little uh, notebook right here these are by the jot brand from the dollar tree cynthia has given me a whole lot of these and i love decorating them i make like little dividers sometimes i'll make covers um but i'm actually going to be doing a mickey mouse theme um i have one of lee's nieces is going to disney world so i thought it would be fun to make her a little book where she can write down like her little memories um but yeah so like i said these are basically like the dupes to the happy planner micros um they're just like little notebooks where you can just write down a bunch of like little different things um i'm actually going to keep the cover as is it's beautiful i love the blue rings i love the blue i think i'm just going to incorporate like a little mickey um thing on there and then it says create and inspire and dream and then I'm gonna make I think three dividers for it and then I am going to add a little decor to the back so I'm gonna keep it nice and simple she is uh, um, uh, a little bit on the younger side so I'm pretty sure she doesn't really care how elaborate it looks or anything like that I thought it would just be something fun and then this gives me a way to kind of just finish up some of my Mickey Mouse collection because I really don't have a lot I have you know like this sheet and I have a few like little decorative pieces so perfect time to get rid of it um so like I said I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the sheets that I'm going to be using for my dividers so these are actually the three that I'm going to be using this blue this green and this orange kind of inspired by the colors on this little scrapbook paper right here and then I thought I would pull out the yellow one so that I can make um divider tabs and I thought this would be a fun way to do that as well. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to look for my paper trimmer because I have no, oh, here it is. Um, you guys should see my desk. It is seriously a big mess. Let me grab my divider um, punch. So here we go. This is the little uh, tab punch that I've been using to create my own little tabs for my dividers. I love it. It works really, really well. Um, I already do have a template because, you know, I've done this a few times. This is kind of my little template that I work by. And this is going to be the size of my divider. So we are going to be laminating. So I do have my scotch laminator. This one actually works really fast. So this is the one that I plugged and I really like it. So we're going to go ahead and start by, um, first I'm going to just kind of layer the top just like that. Oh baby, what am I trying to do? 
go ahead and add my little punches everything looks good um this is always the part that stresses me out um, because I'm worried that it's not like gonna fit I think it should be fine um, I just want to see kind of where I have to lay it okay so I think this is kind of where I have to put it right here oh it is kind of thick so I don't know darn it I forgot about that um, okay no I think it'll fit I think it'll go in just gonna have to make sure I push it in really good. Yay, that worked. Okay, we got two more to go. Okay, let's add it. Yeah, this one's a little thicker. I think it's in though, so. Okay, one more. Come on. And then you have to kind of keep in mind which one you want to be the front and which one you want to be the back side. So just make sure you're punching on the correct side. Oh, we did it, you guys. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and add our little tab punches. I'm just going to add some adhesive. I think I want this one to be number one, number two, and then this one will be number three. So we're going to start at the bottom. Just like that. And then I'll probably just give her like a little pen so that she can write like what she wants each tab to be. It's more so that she, you know, can flip through her dividers easily. Okay. And then you guys so cute okay so then I'm going to put them in I love this one so cute with Donald Duck okay now I think we're good. Look at how cute that is. Oh my goodness, I love it. Let me grab my Happy Planner Mickey Mouse book. Alright, so here we have this one. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and add. Oh my god, this one with all the friends is so cute.
there we have it, you guys. That is the super cute little Mickey Mouse notebook that I created for my boyfriend's niece. Super cute. So here we have our little fun cover. Then we have our little cover in the back. We have some notes. Our first divider with our tab. It is nice and double-sided. And then here we have another little section that says making memories. A trip to remember. And then here we have the Let's Play, the Thrill of Disney, and then the Best Place in the World, Mickey Mouse, and then a few little fun stickers. And that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you guys so much for hanging out and crafting with me. If you guys want to see more, definitely give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!